So apparently I was loathed by the men in that for a long time, possibly still. Rosie O'Donnell is finally addressing that controversial move on her talk show back in the 90s, spoiling the ending to Fight Club. At the time, the actress turned daytime host saw an early screening of the 20th Century Fox cult classic that stars Brad Pitt and Edward Norton and hated the violence and themes depicted in the film so much so that she proceeded to tell her national audience the big twist ending in hopes the revelation would deter them from buying a ticket. However, in a recent interview, interview on Sirius XM's The Jess Cable Show, O'Donnell said there was no malice to her actions. I was saying, you know, the sixth sense makes sense, but this one doesn't make sense because the thing at the end is sort of, well, I don't want to say, but I'm, listen, it's that, that's what I did. To be clear, O'Donnell did not simply allude to a twist. She gave away the ending. On the 2000 DVD commentary for Fight Club, Pitt, who played Tyler Durden, said of O'Donnell, I guess that is okay, she hated it. She was saying this movie disturbed me. She could not sleep for nights. It hit a nerve. It struck some nerve whether she wanted to look at it or not. But the deal was she gave away the ending on national television. That's just unforgivable. Despite all that blowback, O'Donnell explained that she did not hear any flack from anyone until she says, of all people, Courtney Love made an appearance on her show. She says to me, oh my God, Ed Norton and you know, who else was in that? Let me try to think. Brad Pitt. Ed Norton and Brad Pitt, they're so mad at you for what you did. I was like, what did I do? She continued noting, I didn't have like, oh my God, I want to hurt these people. I just had my normal blabbering on about feelings about the movie. I guess I ruined it for the people who were, you know, who had worked so hard on it. And I should be care more careful with what I say in, in a negative way about a movie. You know, if you don't like it, just don't mention it. For more on this story, head to THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.